So I've previously shared a little bit about some of my moving logistics, just in case those are people are interested, from when I moved to California to Washington State in 2019. And I came up with a list, got them out, and then kind of kept remembering stuff after that. And I remembered a few more things I forgot. <laughs> so uh, this is one, I'm going to cover car insurance, this one, and then I'm thinking potentially of doing a video tomorrow where I cover um, leaving my student email and Amazon students. Which is because I was uh, enrolled in a graduate program, and so there was sc school changes that to like real world changes that I went through. That I was like, Meh. yeah. <laughs> so I thought it was so. This is on transferring my car insurance. This is California to Washington State, 2019 move. So I moved um, back to Washington State, October, November, 2019, and this one actually was. So I moved October, November, 2019 and my payment was due March, 2020. And so I had to get my change of address in and I was like, with some of the, my stuff, like, um, some, just with some of my stuff, logistically, it was a change of address. I submitted a change of address. With car insurance, it was actually a little bit different. Um, the plans with my insurance company were not actually identical in California and Washington state. So I had to go back through the, like here, um, go back through what was included in my insurance plan. And essentially, so I, it was a change of address, but with that change of address also came Fortunately, my, my car was already registered in Washington State. I didn't change the registration when I lived in California. So um, I did change my driver's license, but not my car tabs and uh, um, registration and stuff because I actually did keep it here for part of the time at my parents' house. Um, but with the car insurance, it was a... Uh, I submitted the change of address and then with the change of address, there was a little bit of... And it kind of... It, I went through it with my dad and my mom but my dad was the one I kind of like was like it's not the same <laughs> in California and Washington state and so there was like the stuff that was the same across states and then the things that were different and the adjustment and the new estimate and it went from like it was like 600 some dollars every six months in California and it went up by about 200 dollars to about 800 dollars every six months um and I was like, what the heck? And there were like three items that were actually different. And the options here in Washington state were different than what they were in California. So I did actually, in changing states, I did actually have to change my insurance plan. If done other than the defaults were different and they didn't, you know, that kind of stuff. And they didn't have the offerings of the other state. And so I was like, that was something I did not know. <laughs> um, and AAA was the same roadside assistance. I ended up dropping that because it turns out my car insurance comes with roadside assistance. And I, I noticed that when I started printing out my card. I was like, it says it has roadside assistance on it. Um, and so I was just kind of like, you know, I end, ended up dropping AAA. Yeah, I'm Tans Corley Leonardi, she, her, hers of Seattle. Um, I'm filming this Saturday, 4 May 2024, so a number of years later that I was just like, yeah, this was one that was kind of a shocker. It was, it was, it's not the same. There's actually different options. The amount is different. It's just because I moved states. Hmm. It, my dad was kind of like, hmm. And my mom was kind of like, hmm. <laughs> so it was, there we go. Um, in terms of looking towards the future, so it would be depend. So if I move in with my friend, my boyfriend, Josh Kerr, might be, he comes over and, you know, starts talking to dad and then dad calls up, your boyfriend, Josh Kerr, is here to help you move your stuff. You're right, I'm moving in with him. Um, that kind of thing. Maybe that thing. Um, exactly. <laughs> um, or close to that. And uh, we move my stuff in. If we keep the car, then it's a change in we're um, currently living, I'm currently living in the northern suburbs of Seattle, Seattle area. So if we, I move in with him and he is living in the Seattle area, then it's a change of address, not necessarily a change of plan, though that is actually something we could look through is um, if he's going to help cover it and or he brings 
with him or he has all job offers for me from people right and he's like oh, we, i want to go through these you got some job offers um i want to go through them with you and we make that decision together since we are a couple right. um be it we start going through it here before we start moving my stuff or we start moving my stuff or we he, he introduces it here or introduces it at the new home or whatever right. um broaching the topic and do we look through it and then start moving the stuff and be like just so you have an idea of what it is or he provides kind of a summary and shows what they each are and that kind of thing um so depending on right who's paying for it currently i pay for my own car insurance um have been since i think it was september 2020 uh my parents gave me a, a grace that they covered it once since i've moved in with them back in march 2020 and that was the one where the cost changed and stuff um and so thinking forwards with josh kerr and then also there's the case of we might take my car but if we only have space for one vehicle and he has a vehicle or we want to keep this vehicle but he would like it in his name or something like that then there's also the like depending on whether we keep my car or not car insurance kind of scenario moving forward as well and there's the and people were like okay well let's say something like that happens and the squirrels say let's say something like that happens and we get shipped out to scotland or whatever um okay so there might not be a man who am i wedding at the time of moving what would is there going to be some form of payment or bonus or gift to my parents monetary um and perhaps josh kerr has his two mile run world record prize money that he would give to my parents he's like it might not be that much money um but it has meaning all right it, saving that money for moving me right it shows foresight and forethought and it's a, it means something so they can spend it they can save it but at the very least it meant, meant something to him meant something to me and meant something to us which is what was it what was it was it about fifteen thousand dollars so a bit smaller than what we've been discussing previously with the like 10 million or 1 million or 150 thousand dollars and fifteen thousand is comparatively small but it's still a good chunk of change um, so yeah, there we go. That's on transferring my car insurance, California to Washington State 2019 move, and but also thinking um, through one scenario of me moving in the future. Um, and I'll link to my moving playlist as well as my moving streamline playlist in the video description.